Harley Quinn, number nine. Harley Quinn here, reporting live from Fear State. And let me just say, I've jumped out of airplanes, faced down the baddest criminals in Gotham, thrown punches at Batman, and filed my own taxes without instructions from the IRS, but reuniting with Poison Ivy to try and save all of Gotham? Let's just say I've got a little anxiety. I'm only one well-dressed and overly verbal former psychologist turned heroic clown, after all, which is why I've teamed with the Gotham City Sirens to take down Scarecrow and, wait, why is Keepsake here? This couldn't just be an easy, straightforward mission, could it? I blame the writer. DC vs. Vampires, number two. The war for the very survival of the human race has begun. A mysterious new vampire lord has already put a plan in motion to conquer the Earth, and the first step is destroy the Justice League. But the world's greatest detective might be Earth's last hope, and it's time for the Bat Family to hunt. Task Force Z, number two. After Task Force Z's first bloodbath, er, sorry, first mission goes awry, Red Hood must rethink how to lead a team of unstable monsters against some of the most organized ranks of Lazarus resin dealers in the world. To manage this unruly bunch, Jason Todd is going to need a deputy in the field whom he can trust to be his eyes and ears. But on this team, such an ask isn't limited to the living. A ghost from Suicide Squad past returns in the cameo no one will see coming. That's a clue. Plus, Bane's rampage, the resurrection twins get carried away, and more clues to the secret identity of the team's benefactor. Joy Operations, number one. 55 years from now, Joy is an envoy, a special agent of one of the Genando Trust. Trusts are corporate-owned cities that are centerpiece of modern society. She writes wrongs for the Trust. She's excellent, perfection, hard on herself, driven, almost legendary in some parts, until one day a voice pops in her head trying to get her to betray everything she has ever believed. All this and also an exclusive look forward to other Jinx World projects coming exclusively to Dark Horse. Good Boy, number one. Set in a world where humans and dogs are equals, Good Boy is a thrill-packed treat for anyone who loves action, dogs, and good stories. Flint Sparks and his human John, both former mercenaries, have settled down in quiet retirement from an industry where the job is supposed to be forever, but unlike anyone before, they found a way out. However, this new life filled with peace and joy is not to be. In the dead of night, some of their former colleagues who disagree with their decision to retire break into their home and murder John, leaving Flint alive in the bloody aftermath. That was their first mistake. But don't worry, they haven't seen anything yet. Turkey Day, number one. The yearly Thanksgiving pageant in Pilgrim Point, Illinois is a town highlight telling the absolutely 100% true story of how benevolent white settlers brought civilization and home-cooked meats to the savages. This year, the pageant is interrupted by a group of turkeys from the local farm that are controlled by alien visitors. Much like the settlers, these folks are just here to spread love, joy, and recipes, right? Wink wink, nudge nudge. Black Panther, number one. New creative team, new direction. The long shadow starts here. Seekers from T'Challa's past have come back to haunt him. Fresh from returning from his travels in space, Black Panther receives an unexpected and urgent message from Wakandan secret agent. Now T'Challa must race the clock not only to save his agent, but also to keep his true agenda under wraps. Because it, if the truth comes out, it could cost T'Challa everything. Academy Award-winning writer John Ridley and Stormbreaker artist Juan Cabal launch an all-new Black Panther series with an action-packed espionage story that will upend everything in T'Challa's life and have ramifications for the entire Marvel Universe. Hulk, number one. Immortal, no longer. A brand new creative team delivers a new, colossal-sized era. The uncontrollable rage of the Hulk has reached an all-new level, and nobody, including the Avengers, is prepared to handle it. But is it really the Hulk that should be afraid of, or is there something missing to this puzzle? Join the superstar creative team of Donny Cates and Ryan Otley as they look to the stars for the next era of Hulk. Hawkeye, Kate Bishop, number one. Kate's heading home, or at least back to New York. And as much as she wants to go back to where her friends, her chosen family, she's changed since she was last on the East Coast. So she's picked up a pit stop case first, a confidence booster to prove to herself she's making the right decision and not going backslide into her past just by changing time zones. Besides, this case is perfect. Swanky Resort, check. Jewel Heist, check. Almost definitely 100% a trap, check. Don't miss the exciting new miniseries from New York Times bestselling writer, Mary E. Camp and artist, Enid Balam.